But today is kind of my birthday celebration because my friends and I couldn't hang out last week. We're gonna go down to Baltimore City area and go to the art museum, check out some shops, get lunch. So I am very excited. I have to pick everyone up and I'm already running late because guys, look, I figured out how to do white mascara. But yeah, so let's go. Appreciate Penny's the outfit. Kids section at the kids. This, like, is it it's, a wrong or a dress? It's a it's a dress. Mm -hmm. The thing is, I would never buy anything from here because I feel like it's too expensive, you know? Yeah. Look at these buttons. I kind of want to buy one for my grandma. But what would she do with it? <gasps> what if she put it in her artwork? La la. It smells like bookstore in here, which is so nice. <laughs> I'll just talk to the plant. We're getting lunch now. Fun You're sex. You're so good at vlogging. Stop making fun of her. Oh, I have a special. Yes, thank you. Yeah. It smells good. These are so cute. Wait, that's a cute spoon. Wait, is yeah. it like dying? No, it like, when it's cold. It <gasps> oh, oh Wait, that's, that's cool. cool. Why are we so easily amused? <laughs> oh my god, I love books that like look like this. Like that font. Do you want to play club? I didn't know what to do, so I just left. It looks really good. You know, it would be a cool transition. This is really bad, I'm so sorry. <laughs> 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 Hey guys, so we're back from our trip and I just wanted to like do a haul of what I got We went to Hampton area and there were lots of shops and little boutiques first up is I got this dress Yesterday, so that's cool. I Love summer dresses. I love sundresses a they're like super flattering and B They're like super comfortable to wear you don't even have to put on pants like I don't really know what else What more you want from this exchange? It's like one of those little smocks or those like Victorian baby war you know get yourself a sundress boys and girls this button probably not what you expected this was a very expensive button i did not know that buttons could be expensive nine bucks which i feel like for a button is a lot but it was very pretty so and this is the back this is the front. I got this from the yarn store. I'll put all the stores in the description below so you guys can check them out. And I actually got this button for my grandmother. I felt like she just would like it. The next thing I got was this Let's Make Dumpling Cookbook. And there were lots of small independent bookstores. That's like every book lover dream, right? I don't know if I'm a slave to corporate America. I was slightly missing my Barnes & Noble, which sounds terrible because, you know, support small businesses. But they're definitely more like in if I was cooler, I probably would like it more, but I'm basic and I got this so I still supported them. Don't worry. Actually, I got for my sister. Yeah. I'll show you if you can see like the so it's kind of like in a comic book format and it has all these drawings to show you how to make dumplings how to fold dumplings different recipes that you want to do i'm actually a pescatarian so i can't eat a lot of these but she's really into cooking now so i thought this would be a fun little thing for her to do and then i got this perfume <laughs> Okay, can we take a moment to appreciate the packaging? And was that what attracted me to this? Maybe. I am a sucker for good book covers and good packaging. I'm gonna give you another close-up of this so you can really appreciate the packaging of this perfume, which we also found at another store. So it's definitely not unique by any standard. It was only $12, so I was like, okay, yeah, like I should invest in this. I saved opening it just so I could open it on camera. I love opening like, paper things makes me feel special oh my god i bought a bar of soap i thought this was the perfume okay that lady didn't tell me that this was a bar of soap it does smell good though it does say finest perfumed soap on the side 
so I probably should have read that. But why would they have perfume things in front of it? That doesn't make sense! A billion years ago, I got this mango perfume from Bath & Body Works in elementary school. Still have a good third of a bottle. Got my money's worth, I guess. Let's spray this on because I feel disappointed that the other thing was not perfume. <laughs> I never spray it on like that. I always spray it on my wrist and then do that and then put it on my neck if I want to. This stuff is good, it's just kind of like kitty. So I wanted something more adult. I guess a real adult would have read the entire package before buying it. Ta -ding! This tote bag. It's a different shape from my other one. So this tote bag is longer and narrower. This one, which is like kind of more standard size, but I use this one a lot and you know what? I understand why there's so much hype around tote bags. You can fit a lot of stuff, very convenient, especially if you have your laptop. College, I'm pretty sure tote bag is gonna be my go-to. I wanted to get another one, spice things up, so I didn't just have one. This is the size of my laptop. And then just inserting it currently. Here it is with my laptop inside, and there's still room to fit like a bunch of other stuff. Thank you guys for listening to me spending my entire paycheck from last week. Capitalism, guys, capitalism. Been like a little busy, but like not that busy. I don't know, energy to film these are hard sometimes, okay guys? Remember, I'm a lazy teenager. I'll see you guys next week, hopefully, and thanks for listening, bye. We're all here together and we saw like the shop that we thought was a bookshop. Yeah. It said you have to be 18 or older I mean, and we're all 18. <laughs> I didn't say that. <laughs> but we saw there like feminist books and stuff. They're so like, oh, maybe it's like a really liberal bookstore. <laughs> and it was not. And we just went in and it was just a sex shop. And they said hi too. Yeah. Yeah. And, and then we just walked, then we just walked away. <laughs> we, we walked in and they're like, oh, hi. And we looked around for two well, seconds like, oh, and then shit. we just walked out. <laughs>